My name is Robbie Frame and I'm a fitness model. I gravitate towards the health and fitness lifestyle and the sport of bodybuilding because it requires the conscious application of a set method over a prolonged period of time in order to reach a personal goal. And this is how I train. Hi guys, Robbie Frame here, EHP Lab Sponsored Athlete. Today I'm going to take you through a chest workout. Now, possessing a huge chest tends to be a priority for a lot of people who step foot inside a gym. Consequently, today I'm going to take you through a range of various exercises which I regularly incorporate into my own chest day routine to help build up size and strength in your pecs. The first exercise we're going to go through is the barbell bench press. The second exercise that we'll go through is the dumbbell incline chest press. And then we'll finish off with dumbbell flies. Now the first exercise we're going to go through today is the barbell bench press. The barbell bench press is a basic compound movement that helps with overall pec development. To start off, we'll lie flat on the bench. We'll place our hands just outside shoulder width apart before unracking the bar, retracting our scapula back and pushing our chest forward. This will be our starting position. We'll take a nice deep breath in and we're going to maintain this breath throughout the entire movement. The bar will then slowly descend towards our pecs, making sure that the bar is in line with our nipple line. From there, the bar will come all the way down with a three second eccentric before driving up explosively through our pec muscles. As this is a basic compound lift and the first exercise in my routine, I will usually do four sets of between eight to 10 repetitions with about 60 to 90 seconds rest between each set. The second exercise in our routine is the dumbbell incline chest press. First and foremost, we'll grab ourselves a bench and we'll set it at a 45 degree angle. The setup is very similar to the barbell bench press, except for this time, we're gonna be using a set of dumbbells. We're gonna grab those dumbbells and have them just outside, shoulder width apart, as our starting position. From here, take a nice deep breath in before pressing upwards in a controlled fashion, squeezing our pecs at the top of the movement. We will then slowly descend for an eccentric portion of three seconds and then driving up explosively into our next rep. I will usually perform four sets of 10 to 12 repetitions with around 60 to 90 seconds rest between each set. Now the third exercise in our routine today is the dumbbell fly. Now this exercise can usually be performed on either a flat or an inclined bench and it is designed specifically to isolate the pec muscles in order to create definition. For our starting position, we'll be lying flat on a bench with our arms out extended. We will then slowly but surely control the weight down for a three second eccentric, really stretching the pecs out as far as we possibly can before driving up, squeezing the pecs together and contracting. As this is an isolation exercise, I prefer to do a higher rep scheme. So I will usually perform three sets of around 12 to 15 repetitions with 60 seconds rest in between each set. All right, guys, I hope you've taken something out of today's workout and you're able to incorporate some of these exercises into your own routine. To see more training videos like this, subscribe to this channel and check out mrsupplement.com.au.